Proudly covering all of Northeastern and Central Pennsylvania, this is Eyewitness News. Good morning. It's Tuesday, December 8th. I'm Cody Butler. Meteorologist Stefano DiPietro joins us with a look at our Tuesday forecast. Good morning. It is a very chilly start to our day today with temperatures in the 20s as we're waking up this morning. Then we move into the afternoon and we'll actually get some sunshine back. So we have that to look forward to, but it stays chilly and it does stay pretty brisk as well. 36 for the high in your eyewitness weather forecast. The wind at the northwest at 10 to 15 miles per hour. Any clearing we do get today is gone tonight. As the clouds increase, it'll even be a late snow shower tonight as we fall to 26 for the overnight low. That snow shower is coming from a clipper system, which will keep swinging through the area tomorrow. A little rain will try to mix into the valleys, but a coating to around an inch or two of snow can be expected as that swings through. We're near 40 on our Wednesday afternoon. Thursday, the clouds will start. Then we'll end up getting some sunshine back in the afternoon at 44. Clouds and sun mix on Friday, we're at 48. Then Saturday and Sunday, we're in the mid-50s. Now it's going to be nice and mild, but that does come with some off and on rain showers as we move through our weekend. Stefano, thank you. State health officials released its latest numbers of coronavirus cases in the state on Monday. The Department of Health reported 6,330 new cases. 5,300 people are hospitalized with the virus, while more than 1,100 of those patients are in the ICU. A 26-year-old woman is missing, and Bloomsburg police need your help finding her. Emily Corbin says her sister, 26-year-old Erica Schultz, hasn't been seen or heard from since Friday night. Schultz is autistic and relies on her family to get to and from work because she can't drive. Erica Schultz is 5 foot 4 inches, 220 pounds, and has blonde hair and blue eyes. Anyone with information on her whereabouts should contact Bloomsburg Police. For more news and weather, head over to our website, pahomepage.com.